Burmese used to be Florida's scariest invasive species, the Burmese python. I can't even look at it, but now it may be not them, but these guys, I'm talking about the killer Nile crocodile, three of them captured near Miami, and researchers worry there could be more of them. They can grow up to 16 feet long, weigh 1,600 pounds, and may have killed some 200 people in a year in Africa. Now, researchers think they were brought here illegally, and since they're not native, could be threatening our ecosystem, especially if they breed with American crocodiles, which are smaller, less aggressive, not known to kill people. There are Nile crocs at Disney's Animal Kingdom, but not at Tampa's Larry Park Zoo or the Florida Aquarium. And crocodiles are mostly in South Florida. We do see a lot of alligators on golf courses and knocking at people's doors. We bring you the stories all the time, uh, like the one at the parish home. You remember when we brought you that story? These pictures just posted to Facebook here. A trapper and deputy safely removing this nearly eight-foot gator before anyone got hurt. And people tend to mix up gators and crocodiles. They do have some differences in their features. If you you look real closely. Uh, can you tell looking at this which is which? Crocodiles, grayish green, they have the more narrow snouts over here. Uh, bring it in close. This is the alligator, more of a broad, square shaped snout, and they're more black in color.